guys and welcome back to my channel God's Grace. I'm here as promised on today to bring you a nice haul on things that make your home smell good. I love home decor guys and most of you that know me that have followed me uh, previously before I started my YouTube channel or Instagram. You all know I love candles. I love Bath and Body Works candles, and not only do I like them, I, I try a number of different candles from different uh, companies and everything. So today what I'm going to uh, share with you guys, I have two candle companies that I'm dealing with here, which is Valespa, and y'all know I love Henry Bendale. And Henry Bendale, I caught a couple of sales. If you all are not following me on Instagram, I'm going to link, link my page below, list it below, and you all just start following me so you can catch these sales because I do list them on my page. But I'm going to start off with Valespa, Valespa Candles. And they were running this uh, their candles half off at this particular time. So this one right here is called Crane Flower. First of all, guys, look at the packaging on this guy. Look at the lid. Oh, isn't it beautiful? If you have home decor that's uh, and you have golds, uh, the metallics, the silver, this will be gorgeous. Simply gorgeous. But this is Crane Flower. And so y'all know it has a, floor, a hint of floral in here. I don't like real strong floral scents. And so it's a subtle hint of floral note. And then like a citrusy orange or, or, or a lemon or something in the background also. And you know they always seem like they put vanilla, vanilla in it. But these candles are made out of coconut wax blend, so they're a slow-burning candle. And the thing about these are they have a nice subtle scent. So I wouldn't necessarily burn this like in a, a large room in my home with a high ceiling, but in the bedroom where you don't want, you want to smell your candles, of course, but you don't want it to be a real hard scent in your bedroom. At least I don't. And I don't want a hard scent in my um, bathroom either. So I, this is where Velespa comes in handy. And I love these candles. Then the next one that I got, because I ordered three, was this French Bourbon Vanilla. Yes, yes. I love vanilla candles, you guys. And then this one has a, I can smell the bourbon. It's overpowering that French, that French Vanilla, though. It smells good, though, but it's a nice, subtle scent. I would put this in my bedroom. And this one was half off as well. Let me see if I have my price list here, you guys. I have quite a bit different things laying around here. But I believe those were uh, 16 bucks, if I'm not mistaken. If I find the price list, then I'll give you the exact price. But nevertheless, the sale is over now, so it really doesn't matter what I got them for. That's why I said you guys follow me on Instagram. And so the next one that I have here is Madagascar Ebony and Peach. Another bedroom scent. Y'all, this smells so good. So, so, so good. And this is an 11 ounce. Oh, it has like a, a I don't even know, a, a must note. But it's subtle. And that peach, y'all, this smells so I should have ordered two of these. I love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Oh, y'all, forgive me, but I just love candles. I love things that make your home smell good. Uh, something else that I'm trying for the first time are the uh, reed diffusers. And so the first one I, I picked up, one that I picked up, was this uh, Goji Taraco Orange. And so these are the reed diffusers and I'm gonna put this by my uh, bed because I like to put my reed diffusers right on my nightstand so I can really smell them good. And to be honest, it's the first time that I've tried uh, the reed diffusers by this particular company. Now, this particular uh, Goji Taraco Orange scent, I have a lot of, I have probably about two or three candles in that note. That's one of my favorite candles by them. 
And so I'm thinking about when I set this by my bed to even burn that candle. That's probably going to work out outstanding. And so let me see here, guys. Lo and behold, I have a price list here. Okay, the Reed Diffusers was $14 each, and I did get two of those. This is the other one that I got, which is Baltic Amber. This is another scent that I love, you guys. I love it, love it, love it. So these were $14. The large gold candle was $18. 18 bucks. And then the smaller ones... The 12 ounces were 16 each. Yeah. So that's how much those were. So that goes to tell you their candles are quite pricey, but they're worth it, guys. They are worth it, and they burn slow, so you get your money's worth with them. And so, moving right along, we're going to Henry Bendel. Y'all know I love some Henry Bendel. And one thing I like is the packaging. Now, look what they sent because I ordered quite a few candles. So, in case you know, you may want to give some out as gifts. Look at this. Look at this gorgeous bag. This is a nice thing. Yeah, bag. guys. These are some nice bags. They have the large bags they sent. And they also sent me two small ones, you know, which will look great as uh, if you're presenting a gift. These are some nice little bags. They do not skimp. They don't fall short. Uh... So let me go ahead and um, show you the candles that I got from Henry Mandel. First of all, look at the dust cover on that. Isn't that gorgeous? And this is a 14.5 ounce three-wick candle. These are some big candles. Lovely lavender. Not only does this candle smell refreshing, just like lavender. If you love lavender, you would love this candle. And, I, you know, I used to not be so fond of lavender, but as I'm getting older, for some reason, I'm starting to love lavender, you guys. And so this is a lovely scent. I would definitely put this in a bathroom, especially if you're taking a nice, relaxing bubble bath. This would be awesome to have. And this particular candle was, oh, $13.50. $13.50. Good price. I'm almost surprised it's a Bath and Body Works candle. And for those of you all who know anything about Henry Bendel, they have some pricey candles. But I can vouch and say they're they're good. They're good candles. They're strong, but it's a nice, subtle, uh, uh, relaxing strong. It's not so harsh. And then this one, guys. And I was surprised they had these different scents on sale. Linen. Oh my God. Y'all talking about something that smells so refreshing. This almost smells like, oh my goodness, like a, a cotton or something. Like, you know, the uh, have you all, if you all have ever smelled the, that cotton candle from Bath and Body Works, this linen, linen candle is awesome. This one was also 13 and some change. Then, Oh, this smells good. Midnight Sky. This all, this would smell good in uh, um, a office. Uh, maybe a, ma a male's office. Because this is almost like a male scent. But it still is subtle. It's nothing harsh. It smells really good as well. And then I got Jade. It came in this box here. And this one is uh, 9.4 ounce. How much did I pay for Jade? Let me look at my invoice, you guys. I paid $11.25 for this one. Not bad. Not bad at all. So let me open up Miss Jade. And I love, y'all, I love white candles and beige candles. As I said before, they are so elegant. This has a floral note to it. But again, it's refreshing. It's, it's right on time. This is a spring scent. It's right on time for spring and summer, you guys. Right on time. 
And that's why I couldn't believe they ran these on sale because I could see if, if it was like the winter scents or the fall scents maybe. But I'm, I'm, I'm about ready to use these, y'all. You all know how we do when we get uh, some smell good stuff. We make you want to clean your whole house. You know, because if your house is not really good and clean, uh, it, it seems like the candles, it, it doesn't have the same throw as if when they're... Mmm, this smells good. This is Seaside. Another refreshing candle, guys. Oh, so good. Oh, smells so good, y'all. I love candles. Please forgive me. If you're not a candle lover, you just won't understand. Y'all know who've been following me for a while, especially on Instagram. I will buy up some candles. And so, Miss Jade, I didn't even take this one out of the box, y'all. Open this one. Oh, I thought this was Jade also, but this is the Boho Beach. These are regular 25 bucks, guys. And I paid for this one $11.25. So they were half off. $25, normally $25. That's a good price. Oh, this is, oh, y'all, this smells so good. Oh, it smells so refreshing. Oh, gosh, y'all. I, I, please forgive me, but these are. Oh, this smells so good. Oh, gosh. And their candles are so nice. This is a one wick, but you all can, you can still smell these candles, even at a one wick. And they burn super slow, so you get your money's worth. So that was $11.25 as well. That was Boho Beach, and this one is Beach. So let me see what this smells like. Oh, it smells so good. I get so excited over I love home interior. Some of y'all know what I'm talking about. When you love home interior, you just like, oh, sometimes I get in the store, I be like, oh, God, calm me down, calm me down. Especially if I see a lot of different stuff that I like. I'm just like, oh, calm me down. Now, this one, mm, I don't even like this. I don't like this one. <sighs> Beach. Smell like some sand or something. Yeah, I don't like this one. Don't get this one. I don't like it. I don't like it. It was $11 as well. I don't like it, though. I don't like it. That's one thing about me, guys. I'm honest. I'm a very honest person. If I don't like something, I'm going to tell you. And I'm going to give an honest review as well. Now, this one, this one, oh, God. This is peppermint. It smells just like peppermint, guys, but... The thing with these candles is take it down a notch. It's not so harsh. It's a subtle peppermint. And it smells good. It, it smells really good. I might save this one for the winter time, though. It smells good. Oh, God, it smells good. Okay. Oh, I'm glad I got two linens because I love that one. I got another linen. And I did give you the price on those. They were 15 each. 15 each. And so that's all that I got, which was enough. That was one, two, three, four, five, six, six, seven. This one I don't like. Eight Henry Bendels. Yeah. Yes, yes. And I got three Voluspas with the uh, reed diffuser. Okay, guys. Moving right along. Something else that I like, that I love. Oh, this smells so good. Y'all, I can't. Let me put these candles down. But at any rate, something else that I love are the, uh, okay, what are they called? Diffusers, aroma diffusers. Not the reed diffusers, but the aroma diffusers. And this is one particular company. And I haven't tried this one, this particular uh, diffuser, because I was saving it for this haul. But I have bought diffusers from them before. 
and this is from the house meal brand you can find this diffuser on amazon it's $24.99 and let me take it out of the box i like it because it's clear and i thought it was really cute and so and if, if any of you all have price diffusers they're they're quite pricey so $24.99 and the other ones that i have from them I didn't pay a lot for those either, and they do work well. And so, yeah, this is cute. Look at that. It's clear. Yeah. So it's the house meal brand. Oh, how cute. So you put the water in there, guys. You put your drops of oil in there. Put the lid on there. Put that back on there. Isn't she cute? So cute. And if you have the diffuser, the oil diffusers, then you know you need some good oil. Now, I'm going to tell y'all about this oil that I purchased. And I purchased it on Amazon as well. And it, it's good. Now, I have purchased some others and it wasn't good. If I can't smell it, it's not good. It's simply not good. Or if it's real light, it's, it's not good to me. I want something. If I'm paying my money for something, I want to be able to smell it. And so, I get these on Amazon. And it's by Rot High, Rot High Beauty. This is the top 16. They didn't have these online when I looked. But they have the top 18 for $32.95. It seems pricey, but really, it really is not because these are good. Look at all those you get in there. And I have the eucalyptus out because I burn was burning that last night. Uh, I had that in the diffuser. And look, at they list everything. They uh, list the, the notes, the scent notes and everything. And they have them in order. I probably done mixed these all up, y'all. But I love these. The Rot High Beauty brand. You can get these on Amazon. And I'm going to link it down below. Put a direct link down below. But these are excellent, you guys. Excellent. Uh, but I don't have the uh, eucalyptus in here. My husband, he has a, a bad cough. Really bad cough. And he hasn't been feeling good. So I have the eucalyptus in the bedroom. And again, that's by Rod High Beauty. Highly recommend, recommend them. And I like them so much, you guys. I went on Amazon. And I like I said, I'm starting to love the lavender scent. So I bought a whole bottle of this, the lavender. And I wrote the price down. $13.95, but you only need a few drops. Look how large this bottle is. This is a four ounce. Excellent. And y'all, it's, oh gosh, this lavender is getting me, y'all. I remember when I didn't even like lavender. I remember, y'all see my nail, I done broke my nail. It's so ugly, forgive me. I have to get it fixed tomorrow. But yeah, yes. I love smell good stuff. I don't know about y'all, but I love a clean house. I love a decorated house. I like nice things in my house. Clothes, mm, I, 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 I'm a decent dresser and everything, but hey, I love home decor. And so, one other thing that I got, as far as the smell goods go, well, I got a couple more things. But I caught this little cutie um, at Walmart the other night. A wax warmer. And it's it, they say it's holiday. But, how, you know, the metallics are in. So if you have silver, gold, or whatever, look how cute this is. And because it was considered holiday, they marked it down to $11. It was the only one they had. I wish they had more. I probably would at least picked up. Probably two or three for my girls because they're just like their mama. They like a nice house and they love smell good stuff. And I thank God, you know, because I love to see young people, young ladies want the want their homes to look nice and smell good. I love that. I love it, you guys. But let me take it out of the box. It's a young lady that we run into at Burlington all the time. And it's so funny because we just know her from running into her at the store because she's buying something for our house, for our home. So, yeah. Why does the tray look a different color? Oh, maybe it's the lighting in here. 
but it's so pretty. Oh gosh, isn't that gorgeous? Isn't that beautiful? I love it. $11. Can't beat it. And that's at Walmart. And I just got that. So they probably still have some. You may want to check your local Walmarts. Yep. And the last thing I got you guys. And I really went out on a whim and bought this. Because I see so many different people on YouTube. They uh, try this brand. So I said, you know what? And they're kind of expensive. But I said, I'll try it. I I'll give it a try. And it's the Caldrea brand. Okay. They sent me a little book. And what I got from them was... I'm looking to see if I have my price list. Let me get it, guys. I'm sorry. I'm bending all over the place. Okay. Here it is. I got the uh, two red current hand soaps. Let me get those out. And it smells so good. Okay, this is a 10.8 ounce. I love the packaging on this as well. I bought two of these. And at that particular time, these were $10.50 each. And y'all, they smell good. But $10.50, I don't know. It better be good. Oh, y'all, it smells good. Smells so good. I just, I just love smell good stuff. Okay, I got here. Oh, dish soap. I really went out on a limb because I don't know about y'all, but I like me some Dawn dishwashing liquid. So, dish soap. <laughs> Excuse me. Bless me, and thank y'all for who, who whoever said bless you. Thank you. So this is the dish soap. I like the packaging on this. Oh, it smells good, y'all. Mm, 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 mm. And then one more other thing. The dish soap was $9. I spent like $40 on this stuff. I must have been... Uh, tripping that day and so then I got the linen and room spray ten bucks okay y'all gonna have to do something now it smells good y'all it smells good and I believe that's all yep I got the two hand soaps one two I got the dishwashing liquid right here, and I got the room spray, $40. So that was like $10 each for them things. Okay, 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 Grace. Oh, no, I got one more thing, y'all. The countertop spray. Oh, I can't get out the bag. The counter, and y'all, this smells so good. It's a limited edition, Dahlia Red Current. This must have been like one of the Christmas uh, scents. It smells good, though. I'm going to use it. I'm going to use it in the springtime or summertime. I don't care what it was meant for. It smells good. Oh, it smells good. And this is safe. I read I read up on it. It's safe for granted. Now, marble, I don't know, but I know it's safe for granted. I have to read up on it some more. But, you guys, that's all I have. And I believe this haul was long enough. But I had been holding on to this stuff. And one more thing that I think will be very beneficial, and I um got this with uh, at home with Nikki. So sometimes uh, when we fry fish or chicken or you know when we do different fried foods or some foods that we cook, they leave a certain odor in our home. Well, what you can do is once you clean your kitchen, mop the floor, and everything, take a bowl and put some. It I've used white vinegar. Uh. uh 
the apple cider vinegar, the cleaning vinegar, whichever one you choose to use, and put a bowl on the counter. Put you some of that vinegar in that bowl, and I promise y'all, it'll take that scent right on out. It won't linger in your house. So that's just an added tip. And you know what? I just, I am truly enjoying having this YouTube channel, and I, I hope you all is, are enjoying it as well. I hope different tips and everything and different uh, ideas and maybe things that I buy, I hope that it's, I pray that it's being beneficial to you guys. And I just, I am so shocked at the, I, I have a hundred and something subscribers and I'm just so shocked, you know, that even a hundred and something people would enjoy me that much to subscribe to my channel. So I truly thank you and you all be blessed and stay blessed in the Lord. Until next time, bye-bye.